people in the national stadium in a very hot warm humid night saw australia beat uh, singapore 4-2 in an exciting final and uh, you can see by watching this uh, final why the asian countries certainly don't want australia in the, to play in their world cup group because the australians are much more robust faster and more hard tackling and, uh, and uh, much uh, bigger built than their, their Asian opponents. But it was a great result considering that um, Australia were defeated in the opening game against China. Australia are in the gold shirts and the commentator is John Burgess. It's the first goal that came up from Hashim who got the second for Singapore. in the Indonesian league. But uh, not now playing with them. Tangpo not before. Hashim Hosni in attendance. Razzali Rashid. He's only 17 years old. Having his first opportunity in a tournament for Singapore. Sundar Mercy plays for Costa Rica. Jay Marnie, but he's robbed by Watson. Watson still going with the ball. Here's danger here for Singapore. Watson still moving. Tries run and scores. Watson goes through and scores for Australia. And you can hear the disappointment in the crowd as Watson really took it. Watson with the cross. This is where Australia dangerous. And a beautiful goal there. John Cosmina rose above everybody. And in the 28 minutes of the first half, he puts Australia ahead by two goals to one. Sundar Murphy now with possession. Sundar still going. Getting to his cross back to Malakawa Razali. Hashim tries and scores! What a beautiful goal! Hashim Hosni scores the second goal for Singapore. And we've got tremendous excitement. I was just about to remark on the fact that Singapore had done the, themselves proud. And we've got another chance. Campbell, Campbell scores! What a tremendous score from Jimmy Campbell. Well, he comes through left and the whole of this Singapore stadium is stunned. Sundar Murthy on the right, Hashim Hosni inside. But oh, that's a poor ball. Bill O'Connor coming strongly, he's got Cosmina inside, Marnie comes back, Rojales is there as well, but O'Connor taking it on his own and shoots and scores a magnificent goal. Bill O'Connor takes on the defence, it was a very poor throw-in from Lim Tangborn, he tried to find Hashim Hosni inside, intercepted there on the break by Bill O'Connor. Uh, and John Cosmina taking away the cover as well. They looked for the ball inside, and Phil went on his own and put in a brilliant goal. And that certainly has got to be the nail in the coffin of Singapore and celebration in Australia. Well, there it is. We thank Channel 028 for those highlights of the match. Of course, it must all go well for the Heidelberg side to see Jimmy Campbell there come on as substitute and score the third goal. And. Uh, Probably the goal of the match must have been the header by our skipper, John Cosmina. And doesn't Cosmina play well? I think this is probably the polish that's uh, come off him after a season with the Arsenal in London. Uh, if we continue to play like we have done, I'm sure that our prospects are going to be great next year in uh, the preliminary rounds for our next attempt on the World Cup. And let's hope that the new year brings the round ball game much more success. The Lions Soccer Cup, a 4-2 win over host nation Singapore in last night's final. The Australians had to overcome the shock of an early goal from the home team and then an equaliser by Singapore in the second half. The expected rough play did not eventuate. There were a couple of keen tackles, but none of the malice that marred Australia's semi-final game against South Korea. Joe Watson scored Australia's first goal and had a hand in two others. Watson still going with the ball. Here's danger here for Singapore. Watson still moving. Tries run and scores! Watson goes through and Physically, scores. Australia had the better of play over their smaller opponents. This header by Cosmina was typical of the dominance in that area. And a beautiful goal there. John Cosmina rose above everybody. And After the break, Singapore applied pressure, urged on by the huge crowd. You would have thought this was the winning goal. What a beautiful goal! Hashim Hosni scores the second goal! It was 2 all, and Australia still had plenty of work to do, and that included keeping Singapore out. Equally good save by Terry Greedy. The Socceroos' third goal was holed by Jim Campbell after a good team effort. Campbell, Campbell scores! What a tremendous score! 
Campbell came through, latched on to a lovely ball. Putting the issue beyond doubt, Phil O'Connor intercepts a poor Singapore throw-in and races 40 so metres to score. Strongly. He's got Cosmita inside, Barney comes back, Rohalis is there as well, but O'Connor taking it on his own and shoots! With 15 minutes of play remaining, the two-goal cushion was sufficient for Australia to shut Singapore out. Ken Sutcliffe, National 9 News.